Right, I need to quickly do this before the day ends because the quest might reset. So there, uh, the Jason quests has been released where there are five objectives and I'll get the objectives real quick. The first objective for the Jason skin is to apply 2000 stacks of blood. Now, as with the case with all mission quests, you need the tower and the Jason skin is for the slasher tower. So if you don't have the slasher tower, uh, I do believe there is a game pass for it right now. But after today, if you don't have the, the Jason tower, sorry, if you don't have the slasher tower, then you're unable to actually. Oh, it's not for sale anymore. Well, then. You're not able to get it if you can't, sorry, you're not able to beat the quest or even buy the quest if you don't even have the tower. So the first thing you need to do is to, you need to apply 2,000 stacks of blood. Oh, bleed. Well, actually, first you need to buy the quest for 1,250 coins, but then you need to apply 2,000 stacks of blood, which seems fair enough. You can easily quite do that with the slasher tower because it stacks blood quite nicely. Then you need to defeat a thousand enemies with the slasher, so I do believe that it needs to have the last hit. Then you need to triumph fallen mode with 12 level 4 slashers once. Uh, that's slightly harder, but I think should be doable if you have other people. Then deal 300,000 damage with the slasher. Again, seems fairly quite well to do in solo mode. Finally, it's triumph fallen mode twice with the slasher face down. So these are like fairly reasonable uh, slasher quests you need to do, but it, it, like, again, it's just time consuming. That's the main issue. So that's why, you know, uh, 450 robux. Yes, please. Thank you very much. I'll accept that. And then you just claim it for 1,500 coins, 300 EXP and the Jason skin. And the reason for that is because this, uh, well, there's, there's a Wasteland Harvester skin. And I, I mean, I do believe the Wednesday the 30th and Dark Harvest are two, two quests that are more common now because they're the new ones. But I can't guarantee it. So I'm going to buy the that this one now. Also, Wednesday the 30th, I assume that's in reference to when the update for the Night 3 was released because it's normally the Jason skin obviously is Friday the 13th after Jason Borges, you know, they want to reference the day that the update ha happens. So yes, next quest, which is the Arc Harvest quest. Here you need to use the Thorns ability 120 times. That's quite a lot of times considering it has a 40 second cooldown. So you're probably going to be spamming it a lot. Then you have to defeat 800 enemies with the Harvester, which I think is actually easier than using 120 thorns deal 40,000 damage with the harvester again I think that might be easier it depends if you can use the thorns ability or not but if even if you couldn't I think that's pretty easy but then the kicker is triumph hardcore mode on wreck battlefield 2 with the harvester one ah uh, hardcore mode with the harvester to be fair it doesn't sound too bad but it's not even wreck battlefield it's wreck battlefield 2 which is the harder map I don't know how easy that is and uh, as they say in America you can pay your way out of it 450 robux though yeah very cool very cool although that being said uh for the quest account is completed only one player needs to place it down the tower if placed down triumphing will count as completing the objective for every player not just that person so you know Oh, and by the way, I am right. I think Dark Harvest and Wednesday the 30th have a higher than average chance of appearing in slots 1 and slots 2. Well, probably at least until the next update, which is probably next week. Uh, just so that people can actually have the chance to buy it once they get the Harvester Tower. Not so sure about the Jason Tower. That's just probably for people who are on the playing on the weekends to get this contract.